I'm Sarah, and this is Chris, and we're from Spiritual Acceleration, and we're here to share some information around some upcoming clearings that we have scheduled on Saturday, the 25th of November, and for Australians, that's actually going to be Sunday, the 26th of November at 6 a.m. It's an early start, I know. Chris, what does that fall into your time zone? That is 3 p.m. Eastern time on Saturday or 8 p.m. in the UK. Perfect. And the clearing is on past lives. Yes, past lives. I think for myself, it was understanding sort of how past lives can really affect us made a lot of sense of the trauma that I felt ever since I was a young boy. And uh, I think a lot of us feel that our wounding starts in our childhood. But if we track in energetically, we begin to find that actually the threads of our deepest wounds go back much further. They go back into countless past lives where the foundations have been laid for this wounding to come up in this life. So clearing any big issues really means that we need to go deeper, deeper than childhood, although childhood is a big area for clearing, but we need to go deeper into those past lives for the roots of our suffering. So this is something that's really making a big difference in terms of being able to actually shift your core wounds. And that's why we're both really passionate about this as a module in the upcoming foundations training that we're both teaching in 2024. So in this clearing, Sarah and I will track into and clear past lives from your energy system. So you get a sense of what just clearing past lives does for your energy body, how much release it can get, and the energetics that we're using, you can actually just feel them. So it's going to be a really interesting tour of your past life stream. Yeah, and I love this topic. It, it's it's one of my favourites. Yeah. yeah, I think it really blows the lead on some misconceptions that we have around the truth of who we are and why we feel what we feel or the beliefs and the misconceptions that we hold because we're carrying everything from previous lives, like every experience our soul has ever had. Our soul doesn't, rem doesn't forget that. So whilst we think that it's limited to this particular lifetime... <laughs> Everything that we've experienced in this life is a continued story of what we've experienced. So, like, I think, you, Chris, you just mentioned the childhood piece, and that is a great place to start. Like, this lifetime obviously is where we start, but then we follow that, we track that. Sometimes we can feel things and we just don't really understand why we feel it. There's no common sense. There's no rationality around what we feel or our fears. I remember personally for myself, I used to have dreams as a child of getting shot in the back. <laughs> I was in a warehouse and I was running and I, I would I would like repeatedly have this dream. That didn't make sense for me as a child. Like I really was quite young and I had it quite often. And so that was part of my soul, my subconsciousness, my unconsciousness processing a previous experience that I'd had, whether it was my previous life. I can remember it being relatively modern in this warehouse. So yeah, it's, it sort of blows the lid on what we believe to be true about ourselves and the unraveling and deeper layers of our, our wounding and that healing process. It's amazing what it can open up. And so it just takes some leaning into an open mind. And I love that this clearing is really going to create some space for us to explore that as a topic where we can really help navigate and understand and just look at the depth that's involved in this mm. aspect, this one aspect of healing. So, yeah, we would love for you to come and join us. Bring all your stuff. <laughs> and do a deep dive together. It's going to be awesome fun. So hopefully we'll see you there.